Hey guys, welcome back to another English lesson. For today's lesson, we're going to be learning some vocabulary. Vocabulary are the words that we use to talk. We each have our own vocabulary. And we can add to our vocabulary by reading different kinds of books. So we learn new words. Think of our vocabulary as a piggy bank. The more you read and the more words you add to it, the richer you become. The better our vocabulary, the better we can express our thoughts and what's on our mind. Now, let's do a simple activity to improve our vocabulary. For this activity, choose the word that has the same meaning as the sentence. If you're not sure of the meaning of some of the words, then use a dictionary to help you. Let's look at an example. Here's question number one. What do we call a number of birds of one kind, feeding, resting, or traveling together? Is it A alone, B feather, C beak, or D flock? I think we all know a number of birds of one kind feeding, resting, or traveling together is called a flock of birds. Number two, what word do we use when we want to say to close or to join something securely? Is it loose, release, fasten, or detach? Next, what do we call something having a long distance from side to side, meaning that it's wide? If it's from up to down, it's called tall. But if it's from side to side, is it called narrow, little, broad, or small? Remember, check your dictionary if you don't know any of the meanings. Next, what do we say when we are moving forward on the hands and knees. Is it crawl, slither, rush, or walk? Number five. What do we call something that has a broad blade or scoop attached to a long handle? Is it a pail, a hammer, pliers, or is it a spade? Number six. When something is very nice to taste, we say it is. Is it delicious, dull, bland, or edible? Number seven. What you have when you feel ill? Is it health? Is it fitness? Is it sickness? Or is it happiness? You can rewind to watch the questions. Be sure to write the questions and the answers in your notebook and submit a photo on Class Dojo by 10 o'clock on Monday morning. That's all for this time, everybody. See you next week. Bye.